former England player, you know, our manager is, must have been very proud to have been involved in, in the history of the FA. Well, yeah, I mean, it's, it's an incredible organisation and, uh, you know, it sometimes gets a, a, a flack from here and there, as we all do. But uh, when you look at all the things that it does, you know, you're never going to get everything right all the time. But it does a, a fantastic job of looking after the game that we all love so much. And, uh, you know, they're all the time looking to improve, which is very, very important. There's a lot of new stuff coming out, which, you know, they've said they want to do and now they've got to go and do it. So I, I think an interesting few years ahead for the people at the FA. Even when I was England manager, you know, we played Scotland in that vital qualifier and just scraped through. Uh, I said then that the players of today are missing something when they don't have England-Scotland games and the home internationals. They played a very big part of, of my international career. My, my first three games for England were all against Wales. So I'd, I'd come for my fourth cap and it's the first time I played against anybody but Wales. So, And I lived in Wales at the time, in North Wales, because I played for Liverpool. It, it's... Um, it's a fantastic uh, thing to have this game back and um, I, I know there's been issues in the past but let's hope it, it becomes a little bit of a permanent fixture again. I mean, it's so easy to get the players together, we all live on the same island, we all speak the same language but we just like to play each other for 90 minutes and try and beat each other and that's the way it should be.